Arising from the dark shadows of the pale moonlight, Fred's world-famous rubber nipple company presents The Adventures of Skullfucker. Episode 69, A Hole in One. Last episode, Skullfucker, using his alternate identity of himbo inappropriate T-Boner, infiltrated the secret society of evil golfers known as the White Tees. We join our hero as he has just slipped away from an initiation ceremony to search for clues inside the White Tees secret clubhouse. Good, I've managed to get away from those dastardly villains. Now to locate that secret passageway that my informant informed me about. You there! Uh-oh, the noisy golf cleats of my disguise have given me away. Better play it cool. Initiate, why aren't you at the ceremony? Skullfucker looks deeply into the guard's eyes to entrance him with the ancient Manitoban power of Skullfuckery. <laughs> why aren't you at the ceremony? Uh, I, uh... Using the secret technique he learned from a bootleg 1980 self-defense VHS, Skullfucker incapacitates the guard. My nuts! I've hidden the guard and tied him up. Now I need something to muffle the sounds of these noisy cleats. How fortunate! This desk contains a box of Fred's world-famous rubber nipples. If I cover these cleats with Fred's patented high-grade rubber, it will muffle the sound. <laughs> now, my informant told me to find the secret entrance. I need to find an out-of-place trophy. What's this? An award for the best lighthouse keeper. How strange, there's a bulb at the top of the lighthouse. I wonder... Get Zooks! By gently rubbing the top of the lighthouse, I turned it on, revealing a secret entrance to the wall. This must be it. This hallway is dark. This is the perfect place to change my disguise to my heroic identity, Skullfucker! Yes, Skullfucker. Known for his skull-like mass and armed with a phallic mace of justice, Skullfucker is ready to take on the flaccid fools of crime. Now to discover the secrets of this tunnel. Skullfucker navigates the dark, damp corridors of the White Tea secret recesses. As he rounds the bend, he sees a light at the end of the tunnel. He emerges into a large, stony chamber. You! Standing at the stone altar, it's none other than Skullfucker's arch-nemesis, Incoherent Argument. Ah, Skullfucker! We've been waiting for you! You've fallen right into my trap! Oh no! Skullfucker has fallen into an underhanded trap! Will he be able to escape? What is Incoherent Argument's connection to the White Tees? Find out next time on the thrilling adventures of Skullfucker! Episode 70, The Back Nine. The Adventures of Skullfucker, brought to you by Fred's world-famous rubber nipples. When you need a high-grade rubber nipple, think Fred's. <laughs>